shot in the face during a possible road rage incident. An Indianapolis woman is recovering in the hospital with a long road ahead of her. WRTV's Jessica Grundling spoke with 25 year old Tabby Reed's grandmother and shares her message to other drivers. On Tuesday afternoon, Alice Story is sitting inside Lou Malnati's pizzeria in Broad Ripple. This is where her granddaughter Tabby Reed works. She's both the face to our guests, but she's very much one of the core arteries of the heart of the store. Tabby has been my tag alone since she was 16 years old after her father passed away. And she's been my best buddy, my best girlfriend. The restaurant is now a place of support. It means the world to me. On November 25th, Alice says she was running to the store when she got a call from her grandson. He said, there's somebody here that wants to talk to you about Tabby. And I said, what about Tabby? He said she'd been shot. It happened near South State Avenue in East Washington. Alice tells us Tabby was near the train tracks on State Avenue when the car in front of her was either stopped or driving very slowly. Alice says Tabby honked at that person and then passed them. That's when the other driver allegedly shot her, the bullet hitting her face. She has uh, suffered brain damage. Alice says she is able to open her eyes and on Sunday started slowly talking again. And I was so happy I just burst into tears. I said, Tabby, you don't have to tell me you love me. I know you do. While her recovery is the number one priority, Alice says she still has questions. This person who did this, I have no hate. I have no bitterness toward him. Hate is not in me. I would like some clarification on why this happened. And wants to stress that using a gun is never the answer. I just want people to understand that aggression, gun activity, whatever anger issues you have, gun activity is not a solution. In Broad Ripple, Jessica Grunling, WRTV. IAPD is still investigating the incident. No arrests have been made. All five Lou Malnati's locations will be helping with Tabby Reed's recovery. You can find more information at WRTV.com. So far this year, there have been 54 road rage incidents with shots fired. That's across Marion, Hamilton, Hendricks, Shelby, Johnson, Hancock and Boone counties. As you can see, since the pandemic, road rage shootings have spiked here in central Indiana. If you witness a road rage shooting or an incident, make sure to call 911 with the following information, the location, a description of the driver and the vehicle, as well as a plate number. If someone is following you, don't go home, go to a safe public location like a police or gas station.